back to the Garcia Center. I am Eugene, Eugene Solis, and today we're completing our corn project. So we worked on actual corn, the cob part, or the kernels. And then we're, today we're make our stock and the husk, and then the patterns on the side. For that, you're going to need your yellow paper, brown paper. This should be um, held together by uh, a paper clip, as well as glue, scissors, a pencil and markers. And again, if you need help with some cutting out certain shapes, we have the husk cape right here next to the corn shape. It's like a giant teardrop. So for mine, I'm gonna go ahead and you can make up to two pieces or three, I'm gonna do four. And I'm just gonna draw it up myself, but again, you can always use the template. Just go ahead and just draw four. Okay, a little bit bigger. And then the rest of the brown paper I'm gonna use for the corn stalk. Okay, get my glue. Cut my corn stalk. And it can be kind of, it, it can be perfectly straight, or it can just even make it odd shape like this. So I just do it, to, just make it a little odd shape so it looks a little more organic. And coming up with my corn stalk coming from the bottom corner. And I'm gonna cut this off. I have any if I don't want to stick it out of the paper, you just cut it off. I'm gonna grab my corn that we made last time. And I'm gonna put glue on the back of it. And it should be nice and dry. This is still a little wet, but it's fine. Got some glue in my hand. And then for the corn stalk. And the, let's see, the husk. I use the bigger pieces to cover. The bottom of the corn. So I'm covering it up. And then I have these two smaller pieces just to add, to fill up a little bit more of the space. Put anywhere you want. It could be behind the corn, it could be above it. This one I'll put right here. And our finishing, finishing touch for this project would be to use markers. You can use any colors you want, but I'm keeping with the, the fall and autumn theme. I um, use stick to the warm colors like brown, red, mm, orange might show up. And of course, I'm going to try to use black because black when against this yellowish color will stand out really well. And it can be just a basic pattern. So I'm going to just put circles within circles. It's just a design touch, just to finish up our project. So, so these designs kind of just frame in your corn. And make your work look more complete. And I keep my pattern pretty simple, just squiggly lines, dots, circles, zigzags. But you can make your design the way you want to make it. You 
you could do all sides of the pattern. You could do the sides of the pattern. You could do all four sides. I'm going to just go ahead and make some three sides of the pattern. This one I'm going to go ahead and just use nice curvy line. And maybe some triangles. So you can see here I have my two corn samples using our fall color and our, using our fall theme. And I'll see you next time when we start our Christmas projects.